can work a half court set. Johannes immediately comes out to foul. Chicago's going to shoot the rest of the way now. Vandersloot, six of six at the line tonight, and the announcer's jinx late in the game. Classic. Classic. Seven of eight, still not bad. Extends the sky lead to six. There's still a two possession difference. New York's going to have the opportunity to advance the ball. I want like to see the Liberty get the ball to Ionescu. Let her go to work, whether that be in a screening pick and roll situation with Howard. Howard needs to crash the boards as well. She's been so effective against this guy with creating those second chance opportunities. But the sky I like to see switch. Again, that switch happened on UNESCO, and it just made Sabrina think for one second before driving into the rim that last possession, and it allowed Gardner to come over and help in time. See what the Liberty decide to do out of this latest break. And they take more three-point attempts than any team in the league, and only the Aces have made more threes on the season than New York. They look for something beyond the arc here. Sky have really been defending aggressively at the three-point line. 40 seconds to play for this Liberty offense. Liberty certainly don't need a three. They can just go for any points right now. They do go for a three, a very deep one. Romescu can knock that down, turns into a wrestling match on the deck and a jump ball. And I don't like that shot from Unescu, just a little early in the shot clock. And the Liberty don't necessarily need a three right now. You want a quick two if you're the Liberty, or a really good open look at the three if there, it's there. So now a jump between Dolson and Azari Stevens. It's some fun exchanges with each other before the game. Dolson was given her championship ring, winning the title with the Sky last season. James Wade clarifying the scenario with the officials. And he's claiming Rebecca Allen should be the one taking the jump. And that but is the I flip. like I like the move. Dolson trying to sneak in yeah. there to take it. She almost got away with it there, didn't she? And now they're calling a violation on New York. It looks like the official saying Dolson moved before the ball was jumped. Mm. So half a minute left in this fourth quarter. Liberty immediately fouled last on the sky at the ball. They do the same here. Sloot once again goes back to the line. And she's made seven of eight tonight. The Liberty have no timeouts left, so they can't advance the ball. They have to get it out of the rim and try to get a bucket as fast as possible. It is extended to seven. So Liberty hopes dwindling late in this game. Sky defended UNESCO well in this fourth quarter. Allen. Johannes the rebound. UNESCO fading. Utilized the glass. Another quick foul with 12.6. And a nice shot by the Sky defending without fouling that possession. UNESCO hit a tough shot. A high-level shot. But the Sky don't want to foul in this situation. Just try to run as much time off the clock. But credit UNESCO for that. Using the bank to her advantage. You mentioned something important there with UNESCO. Just 
defending without fouling and especially behind the three-point line probably the most important thing at the to-do list right now for the sky to close this one out here is Ionescu Evander Sloot cautiously aggressive there defensively top of the rebound another foul 3.9 and these free throws should ice it. The Sky crowd was incredible tonight. They're all up on their feet now. Getting closer and closer to playoff time. And you asked Azure Stevens before the game, how do you not look too far ahead? And she had a good answer about the focus, taking it game by game. This crowd obviously would love back-to-back -back championships. Right now, it's about closing out the regular season with that number one seed. Won't be an easy route to get there. But the Sky will get back in the win column tonight. This is a great effort by the Liberty as well. This was a tight ball game with two minutes to go, but credit the way the Sky rebounded down the stretch. A massive rebound put back in one from Copper to seal the deal for the Sky.